An informal meeting between the Committees of Justice and Legal Affairs, the Committee of Delegated Legislation and the Constitution Implementation Oversight Committee resolved on Tuesday to amend the Election Act and in effect shorten the period required for the publication of election rules. The IEBC is supposed to publish its election rules six months before the election and sadly that date passed today, yet Parliament has not even debated and passed the regulations. The period will thus be reduced from six to four months. The two-month period is meant for public debate and final passing by Parliament. Those areas are very critical and require, one, for Parliament to have enough time to discuss, uh, debate and deliberate on them, and two, for enough members of the public to have a look at them, especially those who are in the diaspora. The regulations include those dealing with the registration of voters and voter education. We'll be hearing from Elsewhere, of people living with disabilities want the IEBC to reduce the nomination fees it was demanding from candidates wishing to contest in the next general elections. The group presented the petition to Justice <laughs> Minister Eugene Omalwa in his office. Um, we propose that the fees be not more than Kenya shillings 5,000 for all contestable positions because this is an administrative procedure. It's not a way of IEBC making money out of aspirants. This coming general election is going to be the first one under the new constitution. We wouldn't like any Kenyan to miss the historic opportunity of participating in it. The Justice Minister insisted that the extensions being made on the election rules will in no way further move forward the election date from March 4, 2013. For News at 8, I am Andrew Ochiang.